Ladies and gentlemen, I got here the latest smartphone from Realme, the Realme X50 Pro 5G. So yes, guys, the 5G smartphone from Realme is here. Hey guys, I'm Jam of Jamaline.ph and welcome back to my channel. And today we're gonna unbox and take a closer look at this 5G smartphone, the Realme X50 Pro 5G. So first things first, let's talk about uh, the hardware inside the smartphone. So we got here a Qualcomm Snapdragon 865 processor. Of course, we got here 5G, we got 12 gigs of RAM and up to 256 gigs of internal storage. Okay, of course, we still got here some of the cool features that we can find on Realme smartphones, including the 65 watts, super dark charging. We also got here a 90 hertz super AMOLED display from Samsung, a 64 megapixel quad camera setup and a 32 megapixel selfie camera. So the quad camera setup of this one can handle up to 20 times of hybrid zoom. So yes, that is pretty amazing. So yeah, what are we waiting for? Let's unbox and let's take a closer look at this smartphone. Ooh, okay, so first we got here the guides, the free jelly case. Oh boy, we got here the smartphone. Does look beautiful in rust red. It's very unique compared to other smartphones that I've seen and it's very premium. We're gonna talk about uh, the hardware of the smartphone later on, but first, let's unbox this one. Of course, we got here the 65 watt Super Dart charger, which is kind of big. And we also got here the USB-A to USB-C cable along with the card pin inside the box. So yeah, um, I'm just gonna set it up and let's proceed to our hands-on of this smartphone. So you are looking at uh, the Realme X50 Pro 5G. So as you can see in here, it's a really nice color. The one that we got is rust red. And I get it na sobrang, sobrang premium ng Realme X50 Pro 5G. The design is very similar to sa mga Realme 6 and below. Yung Realme 7 kasi is square na yung or rectangular rather yung kanyang uh, camera module. This one opted for a vertical na camera module. Nonetheless, maganda pa rin yung nakukuha natin dito na camera. Speaking of camera, I believe the smartphone is definitely uh, good pagdating sa mga shots natin kasi main camera nito is a Samsung GW1 sensor. Uh, it, it is also capable of 20x hybrid zoom. So um, you can take uh, photos na medyo ma-zoom pa or medyo malayo sa inyo and it will be just fine because of the hybrid zoom natin dito na camera. Of course, uh, hindi tayo nagtatapos na. Meron din tayo ditong 32 megapixel uh, main cam, a selfie camera rather and the other one is actually a uh, wide angle lens so you can take group photos and uh, maganda naman yung mga kuha natin dito and we got video stabilization uh, which is why na kahit nag vlog kayo dito stabilize yung uh, mga shots nyo kahit na naglalakad kayo dito sa smartphone ah gamit tong smartphone okay so um, let's check out first the smartphone well first nakikita naman okay it's as expected this one is made up of glass sa likod glass sa unahan metal on the sides really premium um, it's comparable talaga sa mga flagship smartphones out there kayang kaya niya lumaban when it comes to design so given na yun maganda yung kulay premium yung build quality but how about the camera well as you can see in here the camera isn't really that protruding and hindi siya ganun ka, uh, wala siya masyadong intrusion para sa akin pagdating sa design niya kasi hindi ganun kakapal yung ating camera so even nakapatong siya ganyan hindi masyado yung movement natin dito with the Realme X50 Pro but the best part about the smartphone is that uh, this one comes with 5G inside. Yes, 5G. This, I believe, is the first smartphone uh, from Realme to arrive here in the Philippines na my 5G. And uh, they're in partner with uh, Smart. And actually, uh, sinabi na sa amin, you can get this one for 1,899 monthly lamang. Yes. With a one-time cash out of 6,900 pesos and monthly na 400. So imagine, nagbabayad kayo na 1,899 uh, per month and makakuha na kayo ng 5G smartphone. Not just a 5G smartphone, kasi iba it's 765G. That's a uh, uh, premium mid-range na processor. This one though, this one comes with the latest natin and a very powerful Snapdragon 865 processor, which is really good. For the display, it's a 6.44 inch Samsung Super AMOLED display with a 90 hertz refresh rate and 180 hertz uh, sampling rate. 
uh, what does that mean? So, uh, with the 90 hertz refresh rate, as you can see in here, hindi siya na, ano, with the camera, but we got a smoother navigation dito, and when it comes to games, mas maganda yung ating refresh rate, mas nagre-refresh agad yung display, ibig sabihin nun, mas smooth yung dating ng mga games natin na nilalaro sa smartphone na to. And with that sampling rate, mas responsive yung kanyang display. Okay. That is uh, one of the features that I love and since it's AMOLED, supported na siya with most games, uh, I believe. And then, of course, sa ilalim, we got here the USB-C, the speaker grill, the card tray. We also got here the volume rocker and uh, the power button na may yellow accent dito. It's really cool and uh, really subtle yung design niya and I like it. There's no headphone jack but that's not a problem for me considering na yung mga products ngayon is mostly nagre-rely sa mga wireless buds just like the Realme AirBuds Pro which is a really premium uh, we're, we're gonna make a separate video for that one it's a really premium na may noise cancelling na earphones it's really good okay so you've seen the hardware um, you've seen the USB-C but did you know that this comes with a 60 uh, 5 watts na charging yes we got here a very powerful charger. A 65 watt super dark flash charge. Since meron tayong 4,200 mAh of battery dito, the Realme X50 Pro 5G can uh, fully charge the smartphone yung gamit yung super dark charger niya uh, in just 30 minutes. That's 30 minutes na ligo lang kayo, kumain lang kayo. It can fully charge your smartphone uh, from 0 to 100 in 30 minutes. So imagine, nakalimutan nyo mag-charge, gumising kayo, kailangan nyo ng battery, no problem. Gamitin nyo lang yung super charge natin, na charger na kasama dito sa smartphone, and then boom, meron na kaya agad kayo ng ilang oras na usage dito sa smartphone na to. So you know the hardware, you know what to expect dito sa Realme X50 Pro 5G, but how about the software? Well guys, uh, thankfully, yes, thankfully, this one comes with, nasan yung about phone natin, Android version 11. It's the first Realme smartphone to come with Android 11 under uh, Realme UI 2.0. So yes, that's the latest version ng Realme UI. And as you can see in here, we got here the 12 gigs of RAM and 256 gigs of internal storage. Basically, the one that we're getting in here is flagship level and since it's 865 processor we're getting here a really good performance a really power efficient na processor and yes it's great for gaming speaking of gaming i've actually tried different games um i've tried genshin impact i've tried wild drift and everything is running pretty well actually i'm gonna sh i'm gonna show you uh, a short clip lang dito na running genshin impact sa realme x50 pro 5g so as you can see in here, we're running Genshin Impact. I'm gonna show you yung settings natin dito. So as you can see in here, settings, graphics, uh, we're, we're overclocked na talaga dito as like, like yung mga other smartphones natin. And we've set it up at the highest settings possible. So yan, high. Ano bang kulang natin? Yan, extreme. High. Okay, high. Okay, this is the highest settings possible with Genshin Impact. And as you can see in here, Sobrang smooth ng smartphone na to. Combine pa natin 90 hertz refresh rate. Sayang lang kasi dito sa game na to, uh, we're only stuck at uh, 60 frames per second. Um, as you can see in here sa graphics, 60 frames, wala tayong 90 hertz na, or 90 FPS dito. But as you can see in here, wala tayong problema. 865 um, processor can handle the game just fine and walang ka problem problema it's super smooth and i would love to use this smartphone for gaming i believe meron din siyang vapor cooling sa loob so mas uh, mas cool siya compared to other smartphones hindi kayo problema pag naglalaro kayo ng matagal kasi nga meron tayong cooling chamber dito sa smartphone na to You've seen everything dito sa smartphone, the hardware, the display, and uh, the software, but how about the camera? Again, we got here a 64 megapixel AI quad camera dito sa smartphone na to. It comes with 20 times zoom. It's, it's compri it comprises of um, a 8 megapixel ultra wide, 12 megapixel telephoto lens, and a 2 megapixel black and white na sensor so na sa likod. And then so nahan, we got here the uh, 32 megapixel wide angle lens and an 8 megapixel na ultra wide angle lens. So makikita nyo dito, kaya tayo may pill shape dito na na, uh, na hole sa display natin. Okay, so uh, gusto ko muna ipakita sa inyo yung mga shots na kuha ko dito sa smartphone na to. As 
you can see doon sa mga shots na nakuha natin dito sa Realme X50 Pro 5G, maganda yung shots natin. Maganda yung kulay. I'm really happy because it's sharp and it's really good. The selfie camera is also good for me and I'm really satisfied with what we're getting dito sa Realme X50 Pro 5G. And the fact na meron pa tayong ultra wide angle lens sa unahan, it's another feature for me na na-appreciate ko kasi I can take better group photos and shots dito sa Realme X50 Pro. It's not the best, I believe, when it comes to flagship smartphones, but I'm really satisfied with what we're getting in here. And again, it's only 1899 at smart postpaid plan, so hindi kayo masyadong masasaktan pagdating sa wallet and sobrang sulit niya because we got here 5G, we got here a powerful processor, and a really nice display, and a really fast 65 watt super dark flash charge technology, which I believe is essential, essential rather, for gaming dito sa smartphone na to. So I guess that's it dito sa ating unboxing and hands-on ng Realme X50 Pro 5G. It's a really cool smartphone. I love what we're getting in here. It's really powerful. It's uh, everything that we need on a smartphone, on a flagship smartphone actually. Um, we got 5G, really nice display again, really nice design, everything that you need on a smartphone. Sobrang ganda ng para sa akin for a Realme smartphone talaga. It's a big leap compared sa mga previous Realme smartphones na in-unbox and hinansa natin before. And I believe this will be my next main smartphone because it has the balance of everything that I need. Good camera, good display, really nice processor, nice camera, everything that I need. Especially para sa akin yung mabilis na charging niya. So I guess that's it dito sa unboxing and hands-on natin ng Realme X50 Pro. It's a really nice flagship smartphone. So I suggest that you take a look at it. And um, tignan nyo kung ano bang ma-offer ni Realme dito sa X50 Pro. So if you like this video, don't forget to give us thumbs up. And of course, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, well, now is the time to subscribe. So once again, I am Jam of Jamonline.ph. Thank you for watching. And see you guys again sa susunod na video.